November 4th, 2018. I'm thankful for my ability to read. You see, there are a lot of um, stereotypes and facts behind African-American males reading. Back in the day when black men were slaves, they couldn't read. Anyone caught teaching them to read would get in trouble. black men who could read could understand what was happening to them form an educated opinion and then lead a revolt or a rebellion it's disheartening because in the black community a lot of times you hear if you want to keep something from a black person put it in a book yet we take this privilege of learning to read and knowing how to read for granted. Too many children say, I don't like to read or I don't want to read, but reading is such an important part of becoming a successful human. Knowing how to read, knowing how to form sentences, knowing how to tell stories, knowing how to interpret things. That is something that I'm thankful for. My parents told me that when I was little, I struggled a little bit at first with reading, but I had a great teacher who helped me overcome that difficulty. So I'm thankful for her. I'm thankful for my parents for recognizing my trouble and helping me push through it. I'm thankful that I stuck with it and I'm thankful that I still love books and I still love to read to this day. Becoming a rare sight, it's not something I'm proud of. So I'm thankful for reading. I'm thankful that I like to read and I'm thankful for the ability to read. This is the Thankfulness Project.